I am not trying to scare you. I am not trying to do anything like that. But what if I told you there is a demon standing right next to you? And you may say to me, Kevin, what are you talking about? Just because someone hurts you doesn't mean you should hurt that person back. Just because someone is saying mean things to you doesn't mean you should say it back. What if there is a demon standing right next to you? Manipulating your thoughts. Manipulating or should I say influencing you to do what is wrong when maybe it was not your idea? If you believe demons have no power, demons can't interfere with people's lives, I believe you are mistaken if you believe demons can't do that. Please understand what I am saying. I believe you may be in situations when, should I say, you may be in or may go through situations where something that is simple to understand, confusion happens. Maybe with some people, no matter what happens, as it seems like fights break out, like arguments break out, out of nowhere. What is that? Can that be a coincidence? I don't think so. I was texting someone a while back and that person told me they struggle with their thoughts. Now, how is that? Like, if I don't want to struggle with my thoughts, but I am struggling with my thoughts, what is it that is influencing my thoughts to go wild? Demons, right? I think so. I believe this is one of the reasons, and I may not be perfect at it. I still need work done on myself, but I believe that's one of the reasons why God tells us pretty much in the Bible to not to do wrong to people who do wrong to us. How do you know there isn't a demon right next to you telling you to do such and such? You may believe it is your idea, but how do you know if it truly is? You may be ma manipulated. You may be being taken advantage of. I hope this is making sense. What if there is a demon right next to you making you, or should I say influencing you, or probably making you feel depressed and suicidal and all that stuff there? What if? We need to fight back. You may need to fast, but don't retaliate in a very bad way. Let me stop here. May God bless you.